morning. I'm on my way over to my mom's mobile home. It's a cooler day than it's been, which doesn't mean it's cool, but it's cooler. And uh, so I'm prepping the trailer for painting. A little later on, I'm gonna have Jay come over and help me move the uh, stairways away from the doors of the mobile home so that I can tape around those and uh, help me spray. Hopefully I will have this more or less done today because uh, I know she wants some trim in a different color but I can do that later with a brush and it's not quite such a, a big ordeal. That's my day. I've been spraying this so this is gonna be fun getting this all out of my beard uh, this isn't like normal um, acrylic paint it's um, this it's an enamel type all right so I finished spraying now I just have to do cleanup I'm gonna run home uh, clean up my hands a little bit hopefully grab Jay, a couple of big trash cans, and uh, run back to mom's and we'll uh, tear all the paper off and we should be pretty much done. Uh, all that needs to be painted is trim and that's gonna happen some other time because I have too many other things that need to be done. So, uh, got the it's only reached about 88 degrees today. However, um, I was uh, overheating outside quite a bit. I was uh, had to stop quite often, run inside and stand in front of the air conditioner because I was getting dizzy. So I know that I was overheating and drinking and drinking and drinking, sweating it all off. Okay, so I am finished spraying. I'm finished painting and it's pretty white So all I have to do now is tear off all of this paper. I brought Jay with me. He's starting on the other end and uh, We're gonna just work our way around cover all the windows and such stick them in the plastic bags and uh, that's it. I want to try and fix this as well before I put the stairs back up. All right, so before we put the stairs back up, we wanted to put the wainscoting back in, and there's a section missing. Uh, I bought some a while ago, so we'll have to see if we have some around the, uh, the place here. And uh, fill that so we don't have cats under the house. Thanks. Maureen, your mom? Yes. She's awesome, dude. I love that lady. Oh, thanks. <laughs> no, she's real cool. She knows me. <laughs> okay. What's that? It looks good. Thank you. Might have to hire you to do mine. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Alright, so there it is. It's done and I'm exhausted. Some stuff for some trim that needs to be done still. But I'm going to do that probably with a a roller or a brush. There's the edge of the patio. It, it uh, looks like somebody cares. So guys, sorry I did not do a good morning and do any other filming throughout the day. This is all you're gonna get. Um, 
just wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update on what's been going on. Um, hospice was here yesterday. I think I told you guys that already. Um, they upped his morphine from two milliliters to three milliliters every two to three hour, every two to four hours, and uh, one milliliter of Ativan every time I give him morphine. He is not resting uh, comfortably for very long, um, so it's pretty much been every two hours, two and a half hours that I've been giving him his medications. Um, yeah, it, it's pretty tough. Um, at this point, we're all sitting here is horrible to say but we're all sitting here praying and asking God why is he not why is he putting him through this why is why is he making him suffer this way enough is enough and we're tired of seeing him like this and we want it to we want it to end we want his pain to end we want his suffering to end and we just don't understand. Um, we know he's a very strong-willed man, but he he's ready. The last he was able to talk, he's ready. He wants to go. He's asked how come he's not gone yet. Um, we don't have those answers. And this waiting game is just horrible, absolutely horrible. So, on another note, um, got a little bit of some interesting vlogging that's going to be coming up soon that's going to be involving crystal and coco mm -hmm. yeah I'm not going to tell you much about it it's going to be a surprise um for all you crystal and coco fans out there stay tuned and um that's about it for now so hope you enjoyed everything you saw or heard from me saw Kevin. I know he was doing some painting today. Hope you enjoyed what he filmed. If you did, please give us a like, a share, a thumbs up, a comment, all that happy crappy stuff, and we'll see you guys all tomorrow.